Three tips to becoming a much more fluid fighter. Here we go. Number one, consistency. What you're seeing is just years and years and years, hours upon hours, days upon days of me just being by myself and practicing. A lot of you guys are asking, how do I get my footwork like yours? How do I just move and groove fluidly like how you do? This is just practice and practice and practice. I sacrificed a lot to have the skills that I have. In order for you to move the way I move, you need to do the same. Dedicate yourself to becoming a better fighter. Number two, jumping rope. Jumping rope is the only piece of equipment that has really helped me to build rhythm and timing throughout my whole body. Having rhythm on the jump rope really helps your timing for your shots, how to move in and out, and it just really helps you to be much more aware with your body. So number two is jumping rope. Number three, it is sparring bigger, stronger, faster, and better guys. When I was fighting mixed martial arts in the cage, the team that I was with were killers. My teammates would put it on me. Now, you will never know how to be fluid with your movements and technique until it is time for you to be fluid with your movement and techniques. I would constantly get beat up. My teammates really made sure that they did all that they could to better me as a fighter. And to do that, they really had to put the pressure on me and just really make sure that I was ready for anything. Now, getting beat up constantly from better professional fighters who are my teammates on a daily basis forced me to find little ways to move in and out just to survive then to thrive to add all of my counter shots all of my pick my rolls how to move here how to move there came over time but sparring bigger better stronger guys on a constant basis really helped me to have extremely good effective footwork that worked in real world situations in the cage helped me to win my fights so those are my top three tips for becoming a much more fluid fighter number one constant practice number two jumping rope and number three sparring and getting beat up by much bigger and better guys try this out let me know how it goes and always remember train hard and be kind